Hello guys! Welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Shine Mary Cruz and good morning! So, marami po kong kababayan natin ang gusto po mata ng Canada. And the thing is, hindi nila alam kung paano maghanap ng trabaho or saan maghanap. Or minsan kung mag-agency man sila, hindi sila, hindi sila sure kung the agency is legit. So, with this um, agency that I'm going to talk about, is legit po talaga yung agency and wala silang placement fee. And depende ko anong position yung ina-applyan nyo, depende ko anong trabaho, they don't require IELTS and ECA. So if you think mababa yung IELTS nyo, hindi sapat for PR, okay? with this um, uh, website, uh, hindi kailangan ng IELTS, hindi rin kailangan ng Educational Credentials Assessment, okay? or yung ECA na tinatawag din. So with this agency, urgent hiring po talaga sila. Uh, like uh, truck mechanic, okay, auto mechanic, magkaiba pa kasi dito yung truck and auto mechanics, okay, machinist, heavy truck uh, operator, okay, ito, industrial cleaner, carpenter, industrial butcher, inspector, body painter, welder, and meron ding um, architectural architectural draftsman. So, urgent hiring po talaga ito and merong deadline. So, when you are applying, make sure uh, that you look for the deadline. Baka mamaya, nag Baka mamaya nag aayos kayo ng mga papeles nyo and then um, deadline na pala ng submission. And ang advice ko is to submit your application as soon as possible. Okay? Puntahan natin yung And then, mag-scroll down tayo. Puntahan natin yung country na saan man yung gusto yung punta. But, in this case, punta tayo ng Canada. And then, click find jobs. So, makikita nyo maraming trabaho dito. Like, truck mechanic or truck technician. Okay, welder, assembler, CNC machinist, heavy truck mechanic, heavy equipment mechanic, auto mechanic, truck mechanic, carpenter, Architectural, architectural draftsman, okay, and pa, maybe equipment operator, welder, okay, industrial butcher. Search pa natin yung iba para makita natin lahat. Okay, wood sawmill. Everything shingle wood slicer, quality inspector, mold setter, machine cut operator, industrial, industrial cleaner. So, ang dami, diba? Na hindi mo naman kailangan maging architect, engineer, doctor, okay, mga nurses. So, itong industrial engine, itong industrial cleaner, click natin ito. Okay, industrial cleaner, sabi dito, ang post duration niya is until May 21st, 2021. So, tignan nyo yung qualification. At least high school graduate, minimum 2 years experience, diba? Okay, ano yung task description? Ano yung gagawin? Clean the equipment, do quality work, care at different cleaning steps. Okay, answer the request of production in other departments. Okay, try natin mag-register to apply. Click nyo yun, and then meron mga important points doon on making a good resume. Siyempre, kailangan mo ilagay yung work experience mo. Okay, supported by employment certificate or mga pay slips. And then your educational background, major achievements like certification and licensure or mga trainings or seminars na inatenan nyo. And then language, hobbies, interests. So, uh, kailangan related dun sa ina-apply mo. So, kung ang hobby nyo ay magtong it's, diba? Hindi nyo na kailangan ilagay dun yung hobbies and interests nyo. Okay, something related to the job you are applying for or yung position na ina-applyan mo. And then, of course, yung references. Um, you have to put um, at least three okay, character references and make sure kinontak nyo yung taong ilalagay nyo as your reference para naman, pag may tumawag sa kanya, immediately nasa isip niya na, ah, ito yung reference na sinasabi sa akin. Okay, baka kasi nilagay niyo yung tao as a reference and then hindi niyo siya in-inform. Pag may tumawag sa kanya, it's either hindi niya sagutin or iisipin niya pa ang tagal niyang mag-isip bago kayo maalala, right? So, make sure you contact your character reference so they can prepare and give you a good uh, character reference pag meron tumawag sa kanila to verify. So, click na natin yung
nandito na tayo sa registration, so requirements. So, mandatory mandatory pre-employment orientation seminar o PEOS. So, pag inisip niyo, ano ba yun? Wait lang, upload muna natin yung photo, upload natin yung resume, and ano ba yung PEOS? So, pag kinik niyo yung get PEOS ID here, mapupunta kayo sa POEA website. Then, you have to register first kung hindi pa kayo nakaregister dito, which is free. And since hindi naman ako magre-register, hindi na natin gagawin. But then, pag meron na kayong e-registration number, okay, you can go back and then put your PEOS certificate ID. So, lalagay mo na yung pangalan mo, yung middle name, and all the information needed here. Scroll down, scroll down, scroll, scroll. Okay. So, general evaluation form, healthcare and medical services evaluation form, registered nurse skills self-assessment form, and cabin crew evaluation form. So, i-upload natin yung mga forms na yun uh, dito after mong masagutan. So, if you are not a healthcare or medical service um, person or hindi ka registered nurse or hindi ka cabin crew, okay, ang form na gagamitin mo is for sure yung general evaluation form and then i-upload mo dito by clicking the upload evaluation form here. Okay, kung ikaw naman ay nasa healthcare and medical services except for registered nurse, okay, ang gagamitin mo yung healthcare and medical services evaluation form. Yeah, upload mo rin siya dun sa upload evaluation form here. Now, if you are a registered nurse, okay, dalawang form ang i-upload mo. Yung health eh, healthcare and medical services evaluation form as well as the registered nurse skills self-assessment form. Okay, so dalawa yung i-upload mo if you are applying for a position as a registered nurse. Ilalagay mo yung upload evaluation form here. And then the last is cabin crew evaluation form. Anyway, since ang ina applyan natin is industrial cleaner, okay, ang i-upload natin is yung general evaluation form. After that, you have to answer, are you a nurse? Okay, kailangan mong sagutan yan, yes or no. And then if you're a nurse, i-upload mo dito yung self-assessment, okay, RN self-assessment form, okay, and then you click register. So, it's hindi naman tayo mag-register. Okay, and okay, marami talagang um, job offers itong iPumps, and iPumps is a very legit company, and marami na akong kaibigan na nakarating dito, Okay, dahil sa iPads. Pero nasa iba-iba silang lugar. Yung iba nasa Ontario. Yung iba nasa uh, Alberta. Okay? And, and hindi ako binabila ng iPads. Kinagawa ko lang to just to help other Filipinos yung mga gusto pumanda dito um, through job offer. Okay? So, agency to. So, ibig sabihin, um, contract lang yung work. But then, pagdating dito sa Canada, diba? You have to find out kung paano ako magigit kaya kasi nandito ka but anyways, okay, small steps muna tayo, baby steps. Um, ano muna yung importante natin gawin? Doon muna tayo mag-focus. So, you have to choose yung kusang ka pwede, tignan mo yung qualification, and then you can up. And I guarantee you, nagpapaalis talaga ito ng mga Pilipinas sa puntang Canada, no placement fee. Okay, and then yung mga qualifications, yung iba no IELTS, and walang ECA, mga ganun. Kung inaalala nyo, mababa yung score ko sa IELTS, or hindi ako masyadong adept in English, or yung ECA ko, um, di ba, uh, hindi ako nakatapos ng college or university, dito high school graduates lang, mostly ang um, requirement depending on the position. So that's it guys, I hope you learned something new today, and I hope na nakatulong ako sa inyo. And if you really like this video, please give me a thumbs up. And if you have comments, questions, or suggestions, you can comment below. And don't forget to click the subscribe button as well as the bell button so you can get a notification every time I upload a new video. Have a nice day, guys.